Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome back. Racer Rick coming at you. Here we are with part two of our My Career Mode in F122. I appreciate y'all watching. Part one, we were in Bahrain, finished 13th there. So here we are on to round two. We're starting in F2 on our career, trying to work our way up to F1. Uh, we're in the Red Bull AlphaTauri uh, Racing School. So hopefully try looking to move up to AlphaTauri eventually and Red Bull later on in our career once we've moved up to F1. So here we are in an F2 race in the qualifying. We're at Monaco for round two. I'm going to go ahead and show the qualifying lap because at this course or this track, qualifying is as almost as important, if not more important, than the race because it's pretty much so much difficulty in passing here that qualifying is important. You know, if you qualify decent, you're probably going to finish decent. So let's go ahead and hop into this qualifying lap here at Monaco. Hopefully we can get up and I'm hoping top 10 maybe. I was pretty quick in practice, but that doesn't mean a whole lot. So anyways, we'll see. See what we got going on here. There's our white car. Driving for Campos. Alright, so here we're hopping here. Super softs. Qualifying lap, Monaco. Not the best start. It's alright though. I hate this track. Especially this turn right here. Stupidest turn ever. Slow down right there. Slow down right there again. It's like Grosjean Hughes up there in the pole. Right now. Here we go hitting the sausage curve. Here we go hitting the wall. Freaking horrible qualifying lap. track where qualifying lap is pretty much the most important thing and we're completely botching it. Getting to the wall again. And we're going to be dead last probably. Yep, dead last. What else is new, right? God, that was a horrible lap, man. Alright, whatever. As we wind down from the excitement of qualifying, here's a look. Hey, yep, nobody cares. Let's hop to the race. We just had no downforce there. I don't know. I couldn't. The, the car wouldn't turn. It just wouldn't rotate into the turn. So I don't know. I don't know what we're going to do here. Anyways, whatever. All right, let's hop into the race. 11 laps here at Monaco. My least favorite track of all time, probably. Welcome to one of, if not the most iconic race circuit in Formula 2. A track with absolutely no room for error. A track that requires every bit of skill these young drivers can muster. We're getting ready for lights out here in Monte Carlo. The Circuit de Monaco is, for all practical purposes, pretty much unchanged since its 1929 introduction. It's strange to consider, but this 2.1 mile lap will take the drivers here around almost an entire country. 19 corners, but not that many opportunities for overtaking. Instead, this is a track that rewards technical skill. Well then, after an exciting session yesterday, let's take a look at how the cars line up. A fantastic effort from Guan Yu Zhou yesterday puts him on pole position with Felipe Dragos on you. Side. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Michel, Porcher, Jack Aitken, and Piastri. Sato, Schwartzman, Fittipaldi, Christian Lungard, Tictum, Vips, the Rim Zendeli, and Darubala. Fiskar, Armstrong, Lawson, and Galile Samaya. Nisani, Deleda, Boshon, and Cowboy. There we are. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. <sighs> Starting in dead last. Not a good thing in Monaco. Once again by the GP2 champion, Davide Velsecki. Davide, today's race takes place on one of the most Davide popular Davide circuits in motorsport. What is it about this track that makes it stand out? Alex, I'm very happy to be... All right, we don't care what he has to say. Let's go ahead and get this started. 
Um, no pit stops, I guess. Just running all the way. It's tricky starting with. Starting to dead last. Try to cut the corner there. Get into it with whatever his face is. Samaya. Up to P20. Centered in on a couple folks there. Crap. Here we go with the nonsense. Stop and go. Like freaking LA traffic here. Okay, we were able to bully our way up to 17th. See if we can hold it. Here we are with the replay of the start, which is pretty much the only passing that we did. Here we go, moving in. It started in dead last, 22nd. Moved up on the inside. Got back in within the track limits. Moved up there to 20th. So here we are in 20th after the start. Here we are in 20th after the start, moved up two spots. About to send it in. Coming up to the right hander. Here we go, looking to the inside. Send it in on those two guys. Got closed off by one of them. They come up as a dead stop. Into the good old hairpin. The worst turn in all of motorsports. And then we that guy held up and we just went around and moved up to 17th. They must have got jammed up behind us because... What? What did I do? I didn't do anything. Over the sausage curb. All right, well, 17th with the time penalty, whatever. I think that was probably the best we could have hoped for anyways. Maybe we'll get inside the top 20. I'm not paying attention. We're getting where I'm at on the track. Why is he slowing down so much? I guess the second gear through there. Thought it was maybe first, but... So that's the way to go. Oh, getting sketchy there. Gosh, dude, what's going on here? 
car is so slidey, dude. All right, well. If I can get through this whole race without getting to the wall, pretty much consider myself very lucky. Or into the wall anymore. After those first couple of times. there. It feels like I have grease on my tires. <sighs> I do that so often. About to lose a spot. Lap three. God, this track feels like such a long lap in this F2 car. It's only a matter of time before that guy passes me. That was pretty good through there. We're gonna end up wrecking. Trying to pass this guy. I just can't get any downforce, dude. You can do it. Oh. Little wall rub there. It's hard to impress anybody with your driving. When your car is this slidey. Especially through sections like that. A section right here where you should be pretty flat out, or as flat out as possible. Ooh. Sketchy there. Almost halfway through. Turning and sliding there. Pretty much. Sliding there too. Just so slow through that section of the course, dude.
Oops, maintaining our spot. 17th. Missing a shift there. About six down. That's pretty good. Just make sure I need to get down in the second gear there. Come on, dude. Why oh, is it slowing up so much? There's so much time right there. And then this sector. Tell you what, we're all over this guy. Sonny, whatever the heck his name is. Crap. Every time. Such a small margin for air right there. Killed all that time that I made up on him. We're catching the car ahead. Well done, but be aware these tires need to get us to the end of this race. Okay, so we're leaving our teammate. Everybody's tires have to get us to the end of this race, buddy. I'm worried about my tires. Come on now, we gotta get around the Sani. Got to. Shit. Not like that, we're not. Crap. I don't know how we don't have any damage. These F2 cars must be a lot sturdier than the F1 cars. Got a runny nose here. Lawson's all over us again. Lap nine, three laps to go. Here we are back up with Nasani. Yellow flag. Yellow flag. Someone's come off ahead of you. There's a yellow flag. Yes. Making up spots. I'll take it any way I can get it.
That was a quick yellow. Zinadelli. Up to 15th, baby. Crap. Go back on the Sani again. It's pretty good through there. Best we've done yet, probably. That wasn't so good there. Quick downshift. We have more straight line speed. Mike could get in the sunny. Okay, this is your final lap. Final lap of the race. My God. Final lap. All over the Sani's ass. I want to get too overzealous here and completely ruin our race. Yep, he got us, whatever. Monaco. That's Monaco. As I like the brakes all the way up, all the way down to the bus stop. Oh yeah, we got a time penalty too, didn't we? Forgot about that. Oh. Getting squirrely there. With our time penalty, we're probably actually going to end up being, I don't even know. P18, I guess that's with our time penalty. 18th, yeah, whatever. Well, it's about the best we can hope for, I think. Joke on you. I don't know, he'd do that was so great. Stuff. Skip, 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 skip. Skip all that. Come on. Skipping it. Monaco. I hate it. Qualified at 22nd. Moved up to 18th. Okay, let's see. After this round of the World Championship, here's how things look in the driver's table. Guan Yu Zhou takes over the lead of the driver's championship after that excellent result. Now then, Kalei Valsecki, who would you say was your driver of the day? A we'll still beat our teammate again. Zhu, the Unigil Fossi driver today just surprised me. He was so aggressive. He was a so aggressive. And now a look at the team stand. Virtuosi moved to the top of the table. Meanwhile, Virtuosi Freeman killing it, huh? improved their position. A strong weekend for them as they fight their way to the top. After all, all right, so that's going to end part two of our Road to Glory, racing in F2 at Monaco. Stay tuned for the next one. Will be on, will be in Azerbaijan. Appreciate y'all watching. Peace.